turn them loose this time out of corner number four, the Northern Sport Mods. Underway here at I-76 Speedway. Contact right off the get-go. Trouble for Beeman. He got contact from Ryan Mosier. And caution flag is quickly out. We'll bunch the field over in corners three and four. And we'll work to the green flag out of corner number four. Lundock with the race lead down the back straight away. Pole sitter Ziegler back into that second spot. Trouble for Timmy Garman on the inside as a 14T. And caution flag is out. Lights are out green this time by Lundock. Sets the pace. We'll work out at corner number four. Back to the green flag. Lundock Ziggler running one, two. Here comes Ryan Mosier to the inside. Gets by the 96 of Don Shepard. Shepard back at the line, gets that third spot back. Working through corners, one and two again. Shepard around the 28 car of Donaldson around. Will stay green and now finds himself in the pond. That is not where you want to be if you're Jimmy Donaldson. Lundock continuing to lead. Ziegler still second. Battle for that second spot. Ryan Mosier. Mosier to the inside looking for that second spot. And hard on the brakes was Mosier. Ziegler keeps that second spot. Tony Dugan pulls pit side. Race leader Lundock will grab the caution. Five laps complete. We'll restart lap number six for your IMCA Northern Sport Mods. Billy Lundock will lead us back out at corner number four. Lundock again on the inside lane, able to pull a car length over Ryan Mosier. Two jet racing chassis out front, Lundock and Mosier, the 41 in the 18th seat. On the inside, Ryan Mosier had to look for the race lead. They'll sail off into corners one and two. And again, Lundock pushes up the racetrack. Mosier hunting that bottom groove through corners one and two as they run down the back straight away. Through corners three and four. Again, Lundock getting tight here in the middle groove. Fighting that ill-handling race car. Mosier on the bottom, unable to get by Lundock. Lundock able to clear Mosier once again. Here comes the 18C, much closer that time. Up to the left rear corner panel was Mosier. Again to the inside, Lundock on the outside. Mosier looking for the lead. Lundock able to power back on the outside. Settles back in front of Mosier as they work through corners three and four. Top two cars driving away from the rest of the field. They'll sail it off into corners one and two. Lundock with that momentum on a little higher groove, able to drive back by Mosier each time they get side by side. Up to the door panel that time was Ryan Mosier. And again, into corners one and two. Lundock on the outside, Mosier on the inside, side by side. And now Mosier tucks back behind Lundock. Back out of corner number four this time. Mosier unable to get underneath that 41 car of Lundock. They run nose to tail out of corner number two down the back straightaway. Almost a full straightaway advantage over Don Shepard in that 96. Here comes Ryan Mosier. Had a look to the inside. Car length advantage goes to Lundock right out the line. Again up to the left rear corner panel. Lundock able to hold off Mosier. Again, tight out of corner number four, allows Ryan Mosier now to the point. 
Lundock had been getting tighter and tighter lap by lap. That's all it took. Now Ryan Mosier shows away as they work down the back straight away. Mosier now able to drive a couple of car lengths away from Bill Lundock. As the Child's Play Racing 18C, the Inglewood Tavern Jet Racing chassis will lead us down the back straightaway into corners three and four. Lundock second, Shepard third, fourth is Bill Smith rounding out the top five is Mike Ziegler. That was five laps to go that time by. As the laps quickly winding down here for your sport mods, once we got into a green flag run, single file throughout the field, closest battle is going to be Ziegler and Hankins. Down the back straightaway goes your race leader. We'll call it five, six car length advantage over that 41 car of Bill Lundock. Just about the same advantage from Lundock back to Don Shepard. White flag is out one more time around for Ryan Mosier. Trying to go back to back weekends with a feature win. Ryan Mosier will lead us down the back straightaway for the 20th and final time. Looking to put that jet racing chassis in a victory lane. He'll exit corner number four to the checkered flag here tonight and grab the feature win for your IMCA Sport Modifieds here at I-76 Speedway.